Hi, this is Deb from Deb's Days. Today we're going to make a case for sunglasses. If you've watched my videos before, you know I've made one for my eyeglasses. But since my sunglasses are quite a bit larger, it's time for a bigger case. And thanks to some suggestions from one of our viewers, we're changing up the old pattern just a bit. You'll need an 8.5 by 8.5 inch piece of main fabric and the same size of a lining fabric, 8.5 by 8.5. You'll need a piece of fusible fleece, 8 inches by 8 inches. And then you'll need a cup or a glass, something to make a, a round corner. You can also find the supply list on debsdays.com. I've added a direct link in the description right below the video. Center the fusible fleece on the wrong side of the lining fabric. Iron it to the fabric following the instructions on the packaging. Then take your main fabric right side up, take your lining fabric right side down, so right sides are facing together, fold the stack in half, use your cup as a template to mark a rounded corner on one of the open corners, not on the folded side. We're going to cut through all layers. We've opened that back up. We're going to have right sides together still. We're going to go ahead and stitch all the way around a quarter, using a quarter inch seam allowance. We're going to leave a space at the bottom open for turning. And then we're going to turn this right side out. All right, I've turned this right side out. Now I'm going to press it, and then I'm going to work on this opening here. We're going to fold it down a quarter of an inch. I'm going to press a nice sharp seam in that. Okay, that's been pressed all the way around. I've turned this under a quarter of an inch. I'm going to go all the way around it with an eighth of an inch top stitch. Alrighty, I've gone around that all the way, got the bottom close. Now we're going to fold this in half with the right side facing out. Now we're going to go ahead and stitch bottom up the sides. Stop right about there because we want to leave this open. So go ahead and get that stitch closed. You can either go over the same stitching you just did, or move in an eighth of an inch, move over a quarter of an inch, up to you. Right, we've left the rounded end open. Have a case for the bigger pair of sunglasses. And if you'd like to see more easy craft projects like this one, don't forget to subscribe to my YouTube channel. I'll be back next week with another project.